Hello friends, welcome to the world of recipes. I'm Vaishali and I'm here today with another special recipe from China that is chili paneer. This chili paneer can be served as a starter dish or a snack or a main course dish. So quickly see the ingredients. Paneer about 300 grams. One green capsicum, one yellow capsicum cut into cubes. You can use red capsicum as well. A small onion cut into cubes. And two chilies chopped. Maida or all purpose flour 3 to 4 tablespoon. Vinegar about half tablespoon. Tomato ketchup 1 and half tablespoon. Chili sauce half tablespoon. Soya sauce half tablespoon. Salt according to taste. 2 teaspoon of black pepper powder. Grated ginger about 2 teaspoon. A pinch of ajinomoto. Corn flour about half tablespoon. Some spring onion and two red chilies crushed or you can use chili flakes as well oil for frying we are using lots of chilies in this bar recipe as it is a chili paneer so varieties of chilies will be there today i am using yellow and green capsicum if you want you can use red bell peppers as well let's start with the recipe now first we need to fry this paneer pieces so what i'll do I have this all-purpose flour or maida. I just add pinch of salt to this and make paste by adding little water. We need to coat these paneer pieces with this all-purpose flour batter and then we need to fry it. So we need little loose batter. Make sure there are no lumps in this batter and it should not form very thick layer on the paneer. So accordingly we have to make this batter. I need little more water here. Remove all the lumps. The batter is ready now. Now what I am going to do, I will dip paneer pieces in this batter. I will put it in hot oil. The oil is already heating. I will dip each paneer piece like this here. Put it in the oil. Now this funny pieces has turned slightly brown in color or slightly golden. We don't want to make it more brown. This is done. Take it on a tissue towel. Drain out all excess oil on the kitchen towel. Now these paneer pieces are fried. Now let's make sauce for this. We can use same oil for making sauce. We'll remove excess oil. And we'll just keep about half tablespoon of oil here. Now this pan is heating. I'm using the same pan. I have just kept half tablespoon of oil in this. Now this oil is hot. Now I'll add this ginger paste. Just started this green vessel. Adding this green chili. Thank you. 
Now these three leaves are cooked. It took about half a minute. Now I'm going to add this so onions. And cook onion till it turns to the translucent. Now this onion is turned little translucent. In Chinese recipe, we don't uh, cook this vegetables too much. We have to have those kind of crunchy bites of vegetables in Chinese cooking. Now I'm going to add all the sauces. Tomato ketchup. I'm adding about one and a half tablespoon of tomato ketchup here. Soya sauce about half tablespoon. Chili sauce half tablespoon. I'm using my eyeball. If you're not sure about the measurement, you can always measure it in a spoon. And this vinegar. This gives that extra zing to this dish. I will add this corn flour to about half a cup of water. Mix it properly. This will give volume to this sauce. And add in here. Now add spices like paper powder. This azinomoto. This is to give extra zing to the Chinese cooking. Salt. You have to be careful with salt. Add little salt first then check it out and then add the remaining one. And this red chili is now. Lots of chilies because it's a chili money. And finally, add this capsicum. We don't want to cook this capsicum. Cut it for half a minute, and that's it's done. Now, add in this paneer. And mix it properly. All the paneer should be covered by this sauce properly. I have used green capsicum and yellow capsicum here. If you want to add more colors to this recipe, you can add red bell pepper or red capsicum. No need to cook this paneer more. So just make sure it, it is covered with all the sauces. And half a minute just let it satay with all the vegetables. Now let's serve this paneer. This is done now. I have this beautiful fan shape serving dish. One of my friend has gifted me this. It's beautiful. I'll serve this paneer. This chili paneer is ready. Garnish it with some spring onions. I have these two spring onion flowers and just arrange it here. Isn't it looking beautiful? This yummy chili paneer is ready. Serve it hot with any kind of fried rice or noodles or just as a snack or a starter dish. Thanks for watching this recipe. For more recipes, keep on watching World of Recipes. Thank you.